We're Americans. What they're doing is un-American, and it's, uh, it's, it should stop. Tonight, frustration in the city of Huntsville after campaign signs are stolen again and again. Way 31 reporter Paige Meyer now joining us live with these details. Paige. Yes, Tom Ryan tells me that he filed a police report here at the Huntsville Police Department after his fourth incident having signs stolen from his property. Now, while it's against the law to a tamper with people's campaign signs, this hasn't stopped certain people in the city of Huntsville from snatching them whenever they get the chance. At first it was an annoyance and then it was disappointment and now it's just frustrating. Tom Ryan says he's had four campaign signs stolen off of his front yard since August. Just Saturday, the Huntsville resident caught these people on camera pulling up to his house, stealing his Harris Wall sign and speeding off. People disagree about politics. They always have, they always will. And Ryan disagrees with his property that he purchased being taken from him. We're Americans. What they're doing is un-American, and it's, uh, it's, it should stop. HPD says stealing a political sign from a yard or business is theft of property. If a stolen sign is less than $500, someone could face up to a $6,000 fine and up to one year in jail. Anything stolen worth more than $500 could be a felony of either first, second, or third degree, with jail time on the line punishable by up to 20 years in prison. If you know of the, any of the people in the security camera footage, you're asked to contact HPD. Reporting live in Huntsville with coverage you can count on. Paige Meyer, Way 31 News. A North Alabama family had their display for former President Donald Trump actually burned down last month. You can watch this story with the family right now on our Way 31 News app or on our website, waytv.com.